Hello friends, it's Prajul Pathak this side and you are watching my YouTube channel Pai Guru. Friends, in the last video of this turtle series, we learned how can we create basic movements in turtle, okay? Like moving forward, moving backward, turning left or turning left to, uh, right, okay? In this video, we are going to learn how can we create basic shapes using turtle module, okay? What can you do? Uh, see, first of all, we will be learning how can we create a circle. Then we will learn how can we create basic polygons including triangles, square, pentagons, hexagons, heptagon and octagons finally we'll create a general program which will create uh, uh, any type of polygon based on the user input based on the number of sites user tells us okay so let's get started with this video first of all we'll be learning how can we create a circle okay for this i'm going to uh, use my ideally and later we'll switch to uh, sublime text tree okay to create a circle first of all first we have to import our turtle module import turtle okay yep and then we have to create a turtle object which we can create by turtle dot turtle class okay uh, always remember this first turtle is a module name and this turtle is a class inside this module okay so when i press enter you will get a window here see i got a window here yep and here at the center we have an arrow this arrow has the name t so if i want to refer this to this arrow we can use the name t okay so let's try to create a circle uh, it's actually very easy to create a circle in turtle module we already have a circle method we can which we can use circle okay and uh, since this, um, this is a method we have to use the opening and closing parenthesis after it inside this parenthesis we have to pass the radius okay the radius is given in the pixel so if you want to create a 100 pixel radius circle you will simply pass 100 here and when you press enter a circle will get created in the anti-clockwise direction so if i press enter see a circle got created on the drawn on the screen with a radius of 100 pixels so if you want to create a circle of uh, say 75 pixels you can simply pass 75 here oops t dot circle oh, oh oops sorry here is a spelling mistake t dot c i c r l okay so let's go back to the command okay and let's correct a mistake circle now it's correct so if i press enter see a circle will be drawn of 75 pixels radius okay uh, see by default it's uh, drawing in the uh, anti-clockwise direction so if you want to draw it in the clockwise direction you will sim you can simply give a radius of negative pixels okay so let's t dot circle of uh, let's say minus 100 pixels okay so now the circle will be drawn in the uh, clockwise direction so if i press enter here see a circle will be drawn in the clockwise direction see okay t dot circle of minus 50 pixels radius so if i press enter a minus 50 pixel radius circle will be drawn okay this is how you can create a circle using the circle method okay let's move further and let's try to create a general triangle okay triangle a triangle has three sides okay so i'm going to create it uh what i'm going to do first let's restart our cell okay restart cell import a turtle model import turtle okay see restarting the cell clears all the above information so whatever code you have written you will not no longer be able to use it okay let's create a turtle object you can give this turtle object any name i am giving this tut uh, t okay sorry turtle dot turtle <sighs> okay a window appeared here now we are going to create a triangle okay how can we do this simply uh, see we'll be creating a uh, triangle of this side and uh, this shape okay so first i am saying the turtle to move forward by forward by 100 pixels okay we have uh, discussed the, about the forward method in the last video so if you haven't seen check this just check it now okay so see we have said turtle to move forward 100 pixels in this direction positive x axis direction so you move 100 pixels now let's say to turn left by uh, 120 degrees okay why 120 degrees because a triangle has an exterior angle of 120 degree okay to create a polygon you must know its exterior angle okay then only you can create the perfect polygon okay so i'm turning it by 120 degrees don't worry i'll be uh, in this uh, later part of this video i'll be discussing how can we find the general uh, exterior angle of a polygon okay so if i press enter c it turned 120 degree now let's say to move forward again by 100 pixels okay you can pass any amount of pixel but remember we have to pass 120 as the exterior angle okay see it moved 100 pixels now let's say it again to turn 120 degrees in the left and it will turn 120 degrees in the left let's say to move forward by 100 pixels and see 
will get a triangle drawn here okay so this is how you will do it uh, using step by step okay but see to create a simple three sided triangle we have to write uh, five lines of code so as the number of sides uh, increase the number of these lines will also increase okay so let's see how can we automate this thing okay what we are going to do simply import rank turtle sorry import turtle create a turtle object t equals turtle dot turtle and a window will appear here uh, what we have done in five lines so let's see how can we create in less number of lines we are going to use a for loop we know that for i in range see inside this range function we have to pass the number of sides see a turtle has three sides so i am pressing three okay and then what we will say to move first move forward by 100 pixels so it move it will move forward by 100 pixels then i will say to move it left or right by amount of exterior angle so yep this is our program if i run this program see a turtle uh, sorry a triangle will be drawn our, uh, on our canvas okay see what is happening here we are saying the uh, these two lines to run three times okay so first i'm saying to turtle move the turtle forward in 100 pixels so it will move from here to here okay then i've said turn right in 120 degree so it turned this side okay then again it will run from beginning t dot forward 100 so the turtle will now come here then it will turn right to the 120 degree that is it will face in this direction then it will go 100 pixels here and then finally it will turn to the right by 120 pixels okay so this is how you can uh, automate it uh, if you didn't understood uh, let's try to understand with four mu few more examples okay but for that examples i'm going to switch to our sublime text tree editor okay uh, what we'll do first let's import our turtle module import turtle okay let's create a turtle object turtle dot turtle and yep uh, let's create try to create a square okay so for i in range number of sides and um, square has four sides so i'm passing four here what we'll do t dot forward 100 pixels okay t dot right or left simply you can either pass uh, right method use you can use right method or left method i'm passing 90 why 90 because a square has 90 uh, degree exterior angle okay so if i run this program you will see a window will appear a square will be drawn and the video window will be gone okay a window appeared a square was drawn and the window vanished okay so if you want to stop that window okay what you can do in the last add the turtle dot done method okay always add it in the last of your program okay so now if you run this program you will see the window will not vanish it will still remain here okay until i do not close it from here okay let's close this see if you have four number sides you pass four inside the right or left method you have to pass the exterior angle okay how can you calculate exterior angle we'll be discussing it in a moment for uh, see i have already written the exterior angles of uh, uh, basic shapes here uh, pentagon has five sides so i pass five uh, exterior angle has 72 so 72 here so if i run this program the pentagon will be drawn see a pentagon draw, got drawn okay to create a hexagon which is six sided polygon its exterior angle is 60 so if you you have to pass 60 a hexagon will be drawn okay you can use the left method too okay for heptagon it has seven sides okay let's use left method here and it will be drawn in the counterclockwise direction okay heptagon it has exterior angle 51.42 degrees 51.42 degrees okay so if i run this you will see a heptagon hep heptagon will be drawn on our screen uh, now let's try to create uh, octagon okay to create an octagon simply you have to pass 8 here and it has an exterior angle of 42 degrees okay and if you uh, if you run this program uh, wait a minute oops see for an octagon we have to pass uh, uh, 8 as a side and 42 degree sorry 45 degrees as the exterior angle okay so if i run this program now we will see a octagon will be drawn on our screen okay so we, uh, octagon was drawn on our screen okay for nonagon it's 9 and for decagon it's 10 let's now learn how can we find the exterior angle okay there's simply a general formula to calculate exterior angle of a polygon it's 
थ्री सिक्सटी डिवाइडेड बाई नंबर ऑफ साइड्स ओके सो इफ यू हैवर थ्री साइडेड पॉलीगन यू विल डिवाइड थ्री सिक्सटी बाई थ्री एंड यू विल गेट एक्सटीरियर एंगल इज वन ट्वेंटी इफ यू हैव फोर साइडेड पॉलीगन यू विल डिवाइड थ्री सिक्सटी बाई फोर यू विल गेट नाइन्टी डिग्री ओके इफ यू हैव पेंटागन डिवाइड थ्री सिक्सटी फाइव बाई बाई फाइव एंड एक्सटीरियर एंगल यू विल गेट एक्सटीरियर एंगल इज सेवेंटी टू डिग्री ओके सो दिस इज द जनरल फॉर्मुला फॉर फाइंडिंग आउट द एक्सटीरियर एंगल फॉर पॉलीगन ओके नाउ लेट्स ट्राई टू क्रिएट ए जनरल प्रोग्राम विच विल क्रिएट द सेम थिंग फॉर अस विच विल डू Uh, which will find general exterior angle for us, okay? And we'll create the polygon based on the number of sides, okay? Based on the input user gives, okay? So let's create a variable sides and int input, okay? It will ask the user to enter the number of sides he wants inside the polygon. Enter number of sides and for angles. We know we have a general formula that is 360 by number of sides. So 360 divided by sides. Okay. See, I am using floor division because I don't want a float value. So I am using the floor division. Okay. Now let's try to uh, create a program for i in range. As we have already discussed, sides. Okay. The number of sides. Okay. If you use a pass five, we have to run the loop five times. If you use a pass six, we have to run the loop six six times like this. Okay. What will loop t dot forward? See, you can also input the length of the uh, side, okay? Uh, but I am simply putting it hundred, okay? Uh, you can also input from the user. You, if you want to extend the program, you can do this, okay? And finally, we'll either move the turtle uh, left or right by the amount of angles. So I will pass simply angle C here, okay? See, if now if I now run this program, see, I have to pass. If I pass seven here, see, a heptagon will be drawn. See, if I open this, a heptagon was drawn, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A perfect hexagon was drawn. Okay, and again, let's again run this. And let's pass eight now, and you will see uh, octagon will be drawn. See, octagon was drawn. Okay, so this is how you can create a general program which will uh, draw any uh, polygon on our screen. Okay, let's again run this and uh, pass three here. So if you will pass three here, see a triangle will be drawn. Okay. Uh, sorry, I cannot run this and this at the same time because it will hang my system. Okay, my system specification is not very high. That's why I am not running them side by side. Okay, so this is it, guys. How can you can create basic shapes in Python? So hope you liked it. Uh, in next few videos, we'll learn how can we increase the speed, shape, size of this turtle. We'll also learn how will how we can fill colors inside this polygons. Okay. So this was it, guys, for this video. If you are new to my channel, subscribe it. If you like this video. Leave a like. Thank you. See you in the next video.